wait i was crying over that because god will say no to your now to give you better in your next i can't get no help in the, i want you to tell your neighbor god's about to make your pain pay y'all are still quiet inside i want you to just look at your neighbor for me tell him god is about to make your pain pay flight attendants secure the cabin we're reducing altitude i can see the runway ahead and i'm preparing to land the plane i want you to help me survive a little turbulence before i get to my key and i want I want you to get out of your seats for me if you don't mind and i want you to tap on your neighbor's shoulder and i want you to tap them real good and i want you to say hey there neighbor y'all ain't saying it like i'm saying it i said i want you to say neighbor oh lord tell them i made up in my mind yeah that I'm going to wait on the Lord even though I may have to wait with tears in my eyes even though I may have to wait with no answers in my mind oh yeah I said even though I may have to wait with confusion in my home I know Lord is going to bring me out real soon I know the Lord is going to come to my rescue yes he will I've got one more verse for you just tickle me on the ivories for a moment and the verse says in chapter 42 I'm sorry in Psalms 42 because you know Psalms has no chapter but in verse 4 I heard when he said in the message translation these are things I go over and over and over in my mind emptying out the pockets of my life said I was always at the head of the worshiping crowd I was always right out in front leading them all eager to arrive in worship in other words what he's saying is I know what it is to have all of these feelings I know what it is to have all of these circumstances they sound good turn them up in the live so I can watch it later on I said I know what it is to make sure that I show up in church but I got to cry while I play that I show up in church but I got to cry while I lead worship people thought you were crying because you were worshiping the Lord people thought you were dancing because all of your bills were paid when the real issue was you had to serve the Lord while you went through your storm is there anybody in here that said I know what it is to serve the Lord and still go through my storm well God sent me to tell you because you made him look good he's getting ready to make you look good you want to get out of your seats for me touch three people and say neighbor God is getting ready to remember you God God is getting ready to do what he promised you pick up your heart David let's go come on Glenn let's ride and I heard before I go back to Carolina verse 5 told me look at what it says why why are you down in the dumps this is the message translation oh dear soul why are you crying the blues why are you sad why are you why are you depressed why are you why are you angry he said I will fix my eyes on God soon he's going to put a smile on my face and look at what he said and I'm going back to the airport he said he said God is still going to come through for you but you got to put your hope in the Lord lean on your neighbor I know I'm from down south so we talk to neighbors and touch people in I know I know I know but uh, can you make me feel at home for me and uh, lean on one more neighbor and 
and say, neighbor, put your hope in the Lord. Some trust in horses, others trust in chariots, but we shall, we shall remember the name of the Lord. For the name of the Lord is a strong tower. The righteous run in and they are saved. He said, hope thou in the Lord. I gotta get out of here now. Only got two more minutes. But I heard somebody may ask me, what does that mean? And what does that have to do with your subject? I'm glad you asked. He said, God's gonna help you with his countenance. You can know what a countenance is. Your countenance is your facial expressions. In other words, God told me to tell you in this next season I'm gonna give you my face y'all ain't saying nothing so when the devil sees you coming the devil got the back up cause you got the face of God and we are we are the generation that seek your face oh Jacob tell your neighbor you can have the houses you can have you can have the silver I want his face I want his face I want his face And I heard The chronological Order of the Bible We see a chronicle Look at what he said He said If my people Who are called By my name Humble themselves And pray from their wicked ways and seek my I want you to do me a favor grab the neighbor interlock arms with him cause I'm over my time now but rock him and shake him shake him and rock him I said rock him and shake him shake him and rock him rock him a little bit shake him a whole lot and tell him neighbor I gotta tell you my secret the reason why was able to survive is because I had Jehovah's face on me. Bless you. May the Lord keep you. May he make his face shine upon you. Give you peace and lift up his countenance on you and your stuff. Cancer has to bow because cancer will see his face. Anthony HIV will have to bow because Anthony HIV will see his face. Whatever it is, it's gonna have to bow because you got a mask on you for the last time here. Get out of your seats and find three people and tell them neighbor, I got a mask on me. Should have been dead, but I got a mask on me. Should have lost my mind, but I got a mask on me. Should have gone crazy, but what the devil meant for my evil. God turned it around and worked it out for my good. Say yeah. Say yeah, yeah. Say yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Tell me, neighbor, I had a mask on me before the pandemic. I didn't get my mask because of CDC orders. I didn't get my mask because of the government. I got his face on me. Open up your mouths, not everybody, just 500 of y'all, and praise God that you've got his friends. Oh my, 
Come on, throw it out of your mouth like an arrow. Scream, shout, shabbat. Show us your face! Show us! 